Please don't forget to like and subscribe to help the channel. Salty breeze, old ruins, dusty roads. Do you recall clambering over these walls as a child? Perhaps. Did we find something at the top? It was an old skull. What a lucky find for a pair of young adventurers. It was easier to climb these walls back then. Not merely because we're older, but because the ruins are too. Of course. You said we needed to bury him. Do you remember where? Well, one would think burying a human skull would stick in the mind, but somehow... No. An old man was standing here as we passed. Oh yes, I remember his face as we flew by with a skull in our hands. He looked as shocked as our grisly companion. Nothing ever bothers an old Ottoman backgammon player. This wasn't the right place for a funeral. We were looking for somewhere more appropriate. Funny, nowadays you love putting men behind bars. You're a fellow of infinite jest, aren't you? The water level was higher back then. I remember swimming through this mire while trying not to breathe in the horrible odor. This is where we buried it. It seems that with time, our friend has emerged once more. The skull is ancient. Its likeliest owner was one of the knights hospitaller who died during the siege of the fortress. I remember now, you said this skull was my father's. A child's imagination is a powerful tool. You needed this. A burial process of your own. A ritual so you could begin to grieve. Here hung those lips that I have kissed, I know not how oft. <laughs> I felt so alone back then, John. Uncertain. Abandoned by my father. I know. The skull wasn't his, though it may as well have been. In the earth, all of us look alike. But putting this man to rest, it did help. I'm glad, Sherry. I find myself rather tempted to keep it. If not for sentimental value, then it's archaeological merit. 